So you can see I have three neutrals and three hots going into this receptacle. Now that is definitely not best practice. This is a mistake that I've made in the past. In fact, one of my former videos, I put two hots and two neutrals in a back wire. So not push in a back wire terminal. And, and people had asked why, and then other professionals had said, hey, you should really do a pigtail. So taking their advice, let me show you how to create a pigtail. I'll remove that same receptacle and remove the two hots indicated by the red wires and two neutrals indicated by the white wires. Now I'll go ahead and take a little more insulation off getting ready to create the pigtail. Take it off the hot side and off the neutral side. Then I'll actually create pigtails that are more than six inches in length and then those will be twisted together with my other hots. So I have a black indicating the pigtail hot coming together with the reds that are the hots. Twist those together with some heavy linesman's pliers or clines and then trim off that edge, then introduce the wire nut, tightening it down. And I'll do the same over on the neutral. Okay, so now you have your pigtails. Additional feedback specifically on this install was to use a box extender because this is wood paneling and there was exposed wood paneling to the sides of the outlet and that is actually against code. So I just put that box extender and now I'm wiring the pigtails into the back wire. Again, these are not push-ins. So you'll tuck those wires back in and then you'll just have the three coming out. This is again, 12 gauge, not 14 gauge. So a little tougher to work with, but not too bad. Get my face plate back on and now we're good to go. You can see that's a much better approach than this jumbled up mess here. You know, tie everything together back in the electrical box and have a six inch or more pigtail coming out, one hot, one neutral, one ground. And it's just a much better approach. Get down in the comments, let me know what you guys think. What questions do you have?